the Palm Beach County judge Friday denied Republican Congressman Alan West's bid to have a court intervene in his re-election battle against Democrat Patrick Murphy, who was still leading West Friday by more than 2,000 votes. Circuit Civil Judge David F. Crone called West's motion for an injunction premature and said it falls woefully short of establishing any legal basis for the court to wade into the race for the 18th Congressional District, an area that encompasses parts of Palm Beach, Street, Lucy, and Martin counties. The only thing I have verified in front of me is a couple of affidavits which fall woefully short of even coming close to what is required for an injunction such as this is today. Crow said before a packed courtroom that included a small army of attorneys representing West. Murphy and Palm Beach County Supervisor of Elections Susan Butcher. Crow said it was not his role, nor that of the court, to step into the hotly contested race and agree to do what West was requesting, impound ballot machines and sequester all the ballots to ensure against tampering if a recount is needed, among other measures geared toward ensuring the integrity of the process. Because we are on the cusp of a recount, we are asking the court to ensure that the integrity and transparency of the process going forward, said West's attorney, Shari McCartney. Crow wasn't convinced, and at one point asked why are we here? He said that if West wanted to contest the election results after the numbers were certified, he has the option to do so 10 days within the certification of the results and that a potential recount decision would be decided by the Florida Secretary of State, not the courts. The trigger for an automatic recount in Florida is a 0.5% margin of victory between two candidates. The margin between West and Murphy late Friday was 2,616 votes, a 0.82% difference, according to the State Division of Elections website. That number could change as the deadline for the unofficial vote totals to be sent to the Florida Division of Elections is noon Saturday. Outstanding absentee ballots will be counted until November 16. West's claim cited the printing error that affected the printing of absentee ballots in Palm Beach County, an error that caused them to be unreadable in the tabulating machines. As a result, Butcher utilized temporary workers to fill out machine-capable duplicate ballots. Butcher has allowed Democratic, Republican and non-party affiliated representatives to observe the process. Crow noted there was no evidence presented that would suggest anything untoward about the current process. Despite the judge's denial, McCartney said she was happy with the outcome. She said that if the final numbers warrant a recount, she is confident it would be transparent. After court, Murphy's attorney, Gerald F. Richmond, described West's legal bid as a political stunt. Asked what the gain of such a stunt would be, Richmond said there probably wasn't one. I don't think they gained anything, they just tried to make a statement to say, we want to have a transparent process, Richmond said. But the process is transparent. They presented no evidence to say that it's not. 